back to my channel so I am gonna do a get ready with me today I don't do makeup at all really um, I know a few bits I don't know a lot um, but I'm just going out for a meal with the girls from work so I just thought I'd do a bit of a simple thing um, so if you want to listen to me chat what's to get ready find out a bit about me uh, stay tuned my hair is wet I've literally just got out the shower um, I sprayed some of the vitamin A hydrating mist from Superdrug on and then I put the vitamin A vitamin A skincare moisture moisture boost facial serum from Superdrug as well on so I've put them on I've done well I filled in my eyebrows a bit so this is my makeup bag I have another makeup bag there and then I've got like little plastic I know it sounds dead bad but I've got plastic bags of makeup what I need to sort out and um, I blame Kelsey for my makeup addiction now I never used to wear makeup. I never wore it. A lot of girls wore it in high school in my year. Like, they put on like a full face. And I used to just go in, bare face, looking ill. Um, which, when I look back at my photos, is very cringing. Um, Cause I also have a lot of spots, which have calmed down over the years, but they're not massively improving. Like, look at that, there's like loads of redness there. I met Kelsey. When did I meet Kelsey? Um, what year? 18? 19, yeah. I met her when I was 16, so three years ago. Um, I met her at my best mate's 21st birthday, and at first we didn't actually speak, we, hated e we actually hated each other. Um, I'm just putting my nose bare up. Um, I didn't speak to her at the engagement party either, even though I was, I was like, I, I had said like hello and everything. And I can't actually remember when my first actual full conversation with her was. Um, and I don't really know how we got so close. I feel like today, like, there's like, there's like 12, 13 year olds that are full on addicted to makeup. And when I was that age, I was out on going out on bikes and playing in like playing in mud and fields with my friends like I wasn't a really I wasn't a girly girl I never really have been um I don't have a lot of close girlfriends um I have I literally have Kelsey um and then I have a few girls from work I don't tend well, let me reword that I don't get close to girls just because of previous experience um it, i feel like these days they are, there's always some sort of drama whereas boys just get on like they get on with life but i tend to get my makeup like two shades darker just because i don't wear a fake tan on i absolutely love curling my hair he actually did my cousins at the weekend and it took me almost two hours just because she wanted it dead big and puffy collection lasting perfection concealer in lemon i have the fur one as well but the lemon one's got a bit more yellow in so it's a bit more brightening so i normally use this and the makeup revolution conceal and define i actually have a bit of disappointing news um on in on the first week of october i was obviously i was supposed to be going to disney for three weeks with one of the girls from work um, and because of obviously the news that I'm going to tell you an upcoming, um, I actually can't go now. So I'm absolutely heartbroken because obviously I was really looking forward to it. It's only three weeks off as well. I'm absolutely heartbroken because obviously I am a massive Disney fan and anyone who's close to me knows I am Disney obsessed. Like I have a full row of Disney teddy is there. I'm Disney obsessed. Um, I absolutely love her to pieces and I, I was obviously so thank, thankful the fact that I had actually been invited to go with her um, but it's just a bit heartbreaking really some people say like well once you've done it you've done it and I'm like no that is not true I'm just gonna get some powder this is the number seven banana dreams with powder but i have actually filled it up with the makeup revolution luxury powder in banana so i've actually put that in there just because the lid on that is 
rubbish. Just gonna test the house then. Probably not. Um, so there's already some in this. There's always something different at, at Disney, like there's always different parades and there's the fireworks, honestly, you have not seen fireworks if you haven't been to Disney, like Disney are a whole different type of fireworks, they're, they're just, they're so emotional, when I went I actually cried, they were just so, it's just magical in it really. I'm actually going away on a family holiday in November, I'm going on a cruise, um, and all the family to go in. So I haven't actually been on an all like family holiday since I was about six, seven. So that's 12, 11, 12 years. So I'm looking forward to that. It's gonna be, it's not, it's not gonna be different. Like, I think it's gonna be, there's gonna be a lot of memories made and all that. Um, gonna be a bit different because there's gonna be a certain family member that's not there. I lost my nan in May. Um, which was absolutely heartbreaking um, and it's very raw right sorry I'm back um, I feel like I, you can see that that has come up overnight I don't know if it's a bite or a spot but it's so sore Chocolate orange palette. I think it's Makeup Revolution. I think it is. Yeah, it is. Um, it's very much like the Too Faced palette. Um, these came in a set. Um, Kelsey recommended me these as well. She recommends a lot of my stuff for makeup. Um, I'm going to take the Clementine shade. Um, and I'm just going to apply that. Ariana Grande, music wise, I don't really listen to, but the Sweetener album, I absolutely love for some reason. Absolutely love it. Obviously, I don't really, I don't get how girls can just sit down for hours and practice makeup i get that it takes a lot of patience and a lot of trying like try 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 again but for me i just get like not bored but i practice and practice and i don't really get anywhere <laughs> it's just me. i said that i was going to be posting every monday um wednesday and every other friday but just because of the uh, obviously the news i've had recently um I am a bit I know I'm I've not posted. Um so I am sorry for that. Um I am I am straying from them days a bit for a while. Um but if you follow me on my social media, um I do like regular updates to tell you when I am going to be posting and what time. It's normally always 8 o'clock in the afternoon that I post. So like wet. I was debating on like my hair is really really long. Um, like yeah. Um, and I was debating on having it cut to about here. So you should let me know if you think I should cut it or keep it. And I think I'm thinking about growing my fringe out. Um, just because it's getting so long and it's getting in my eyes really badly. Um, but let me know what you think I should do.
have another bag of makeup which I have just recently bought. My bronzer. Wherever it's gone. This is an expander as well in dark tan. Yet again, the deepest shade because I obviously wear fake tan. And then I'm gonna go in with blush. This is the NYX powder blush as well. I don't actually know what shade this is in. I didn't actually get this from NYX. I got it from TK Maxx. I find that TK Maxx have got a lot of branded stuff recently. Um, and then, this is my TK Maxx bag. I have new makeup. It's not loads. Um, mascara. Beyond Powder Illuminator in the colour Dynasty. Looks like this. I find with a few of TK Maxx things, like, because the packages aren't sealed, um, people swatch them a lot, which is very frustrating. Oh my god, this is very powdery. this is a good mascara because I actually use the Urban Decay Provision is it? The uh, right ins rubbed off on the mascara that I use. A lot of people actually ask me um, do I wear fake eyelashes? No I don't. Um, I think my eyelashes are just naturally long. My brother actually has a lot longer eyelashes than me and I'm very jealous. So I don't actually know where I'm going out for dinner. We were supposed to be going Nando's. But we're very indecisive. Uh, we've gone from Nando's to Chiquitos to then the Trafford Centre. And we're supposed to be going out in a few, in a bit. And we still don't know where we're going. Put setting spray on and lipstick and then that is it. I'm done. I'm actually gonna dry my hair or else my fringe will end up like this. Um but yeah, I I'm gonna try and post as frequently as I can and I do apologise again for obviously me not sticking to the schedule. Um so I am gonna actually give you some news in my next video and stay tuned and you'll find out. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you all later on. Have a lovely week weekend. Thank you.